What's up guys and welcome to Spore. Today we're going to be playing this game and uh, it's basically a game that has a fun little take on the uh, evolutionary chain of things. You uh, create a cell, create a creature, you come to the place on a on a comet I guess. And so we get to choose our little world here and we can customize our creatures quite a bit. I'm thinking maybe this desert planet here. Yeah, let's do that. Sure, let's start in the cell stage. We're gonna be a carnivore. We're totally gonna be a carnivore. We don't have any themes, so we can't set a theme. We're gonna go with normal. And we get to name our planet. Why not Altarima? I don't know, just what came to mind. Now we've entered the galaxy. Aboard a comet. Flying through the sun. Just shy of hitting a solar flare. And now we impact the planets. Altarima. Never to be heard from again. Oh wait, never mind. Wrong story, guys. Wrong story. We were heard from again. Deep within the oceans. I wonder what would happen if we landed on a planet without oceans. <laughs> there are planets without oceans. And there we are! The little tide pool of cells and creatures. Alright, so we gotta go around and basically eat to survive. These little red chunks are meat since we are carnivores. We want to eat the meat. Okay, back here. We can also eat these little guys too. Yeah, you. Eat him. Go. Get it. I don't know how to speed up guys, so yeah. Yeah. We're gonna be so vicious and scary to all these other creatures. I'm gonna go attack this guy with the uh, spikes. Actually, we'll go hit this big guy right here and see if we can kill him. Yeah, eat that. Ow. Oh. Ah, we ate the bigger guy. So much bigger than us and we totally ate him. So basically there's uh, several stages to this game and each one is more difficult than the last and I found the tribal stage to be the most difficult to be honest because uh, if you're not quick in that one it's really difficult to uh, pass it. Ooh there's more food over here. Let's get these little guys. Go get the little guys! And we can choose the mating call to evolve and change our species. Ooh he's after us. That's a big guy. Get off my tail, you punk. Go after that little guy. Right there. Yeah, get away from me. Yeah, that's a snack. Stop chasing me. Ow. Dang it, he just got me eaten. You see that, guys? That dude just totally pushed me into that other one. Alright, so basically what I'm doing here is I'm gathering up these uh, cell marker things. These. Oh, no, you don't. That guy didn't stand a chance. We're starting to be affected by the uh, water's flow. It's a uh, current. All right. So basically, I'm gathering up these cell points so we can build a better evolved creature to fight in the tide pool. So we got a little bit bigger there. We're gonna go munch on this little tiny dude here. Get him! Get him! Whoa, that's a big guy. Get off my back! No! Oh, come on! Get off me! Stop! Ow! Ow! They are... Yeah. They have that uh, little horn thing in the front. Very difficult to get through that because I am slower than them. Ow! I'm not very good at this whole... Uh, cell stage but I am good at the creature stage guys don't worry oh man they're all after me 
Such hostile territory. Click that mating call. Where's our mate? We gotta get out of here. She's over here. No, oh, come on. Swim. Oh, what's going on? We can't move. Let's go snack on this little dude here. Never mind. Get up there. Ooh, they're killing our mate. Jerks, stop trying to kill our mate. She's our only chance of survival. Alright, so they laid an egg and we are basically designing what's inside the egg. Okay, so I'm gonna reduce everything to the smallest size here and take away everything else. Just to change it up a bit. I'm gonna have a really big end down there and a relatively small one up front here. To make it look like an actual fish. We'll put the jaw back in the front. We are going to use beady eyes because I like the beady eyes better than the uh, stock eyes. Alright, so we have 35 points. We need to put uh, these things somewhere. Probably here. Yeah, I think that's good. And we will put spikes behind us because I want to swing around and kill them. If they want to fight us, we will put spikes on us. Try eating me now, punks. And we can now finally change our color. And we can design ourselves with a, uh, a wide set of stuff here. I'm gonna go with the skunk look. Totally go with the skunk look. Oops, wrong one. There we go. Ah. Okay, so we do have a skunk stripe, but yeah. It's not working like I had planned. I don't know why that's freaking out like that on the recording. It's not supposed to. Yeah, let's go with these polka dots. Why not? That looks cool, right? Totally cool. What do you call this species? Spike bottom. Like spike bottom. Get it? Totally. We'll tag it with sin. And move on. Yeah, so guys, if you guys, uh... I want to see my little creatures in your... I don't know why, why that's doing that. On the recording, it's like flashing weird colors. It's not supposed to. But yeah, if you guys want to see our little creations, just uh, look for this sin tag. Wow, he just fed us a lot right there. I think that's poison. Don't want to go in there. Oh, this big guy's going to come after us. Let's just spike him. Come on, come after me, punk. Ha! Ah. I'm gonna go kill you now because I want that jet. Get back here. We're probably never gonna catch him because we can't keep up. Oh, there he is. Oh, that's a big, big fish there. We're just poking everybody with these new spikes. This guy's a little one. Let's eat him. Yeah, serves you right. Let's go eat these. So each stage, it changes how you play it, basically. And so, like, right now, we're just controlling this with the mouse button. But uh, as we get better at this and uh, more evolved, it'll change. So we're using WASD, and then eventually it'll be RTS style. Oh, man, that thing really fed us good. There's that little jet guy. Get back here. Okay, well, we'll just go after this little angelfish looking thing here. Uh, these fins that they have here, they will give us wings when we uh, evolve into the creature stage, if we use those with us. And we just got massive. Ooh, there's one. Let's get him. Ah, that's poison. Get out of there. Okay. Bad poison. Let's eat this angelfish thing again. Because it just totally ate somebody else. Oh, we're just gonna steal its food and then eat it. Good job. Get away from us. No poison for us. Oh man. They're trying to poison us to death, guys. By the way, eating in this stage, or eating in this stage, will give you a. Uh... Whoa. Ha, ah, punk. He thought he was gonna eat me. Okay, well we got the little suction thingy like a mosquito has that uh, those orange guys had. 
Let's go ahead and evolve again because we have uh, we have enough points to add more spikes on us. That's probably the best bet at this point. Charge forward with a spike in the map. So this is going to be generation three. Uh, what we got here? We can actually add it so that it can become an herbivore as well. If we stick those on the side, we can eat that, but we're not going to. This one here adds a speed, uh, so I'm thinking we might just put those up there to give us some more speed, and then that way it'll be easier to hunt the other guys. We got fast turns, we got speed, attack, and break. He sounds like a sword. That is awesome. Alright, so since this is the third generation, we're going to change color a bit here. We're going to go orange. Yeah, orange and blue spots. <laughs> Looks cool, right? Totally fearsome. Sorry guys, I really don't know why that's freaking out like that. But yeah, it only lasts for that stage. Oh, you want to come after me? Do you? Alright, come spike yourself. Ah, loser. Trying to mess with me. Look at those bigger fish at me. Ooh, there's a big guy. Yeah, you come after me too. Come on. I'll take you on. I got spikes. Yeah. Come on. I'm not even moving, man. Come on. Ah, loser. He's gonna kill himself on our spikes. Come on. Ooh. Ah, loser. We're so much faster now. I really don't know how to uh, use the fins or anything to speed up, if that's even possible, but I see other fish do it all the time. Okay, so that guy was a little snack. Oh, here's an evolve. We got poison. Which is good. I mean, poison's always good. We can just poison them. But it's not as uh, effective. Ooh, that guy just got taken really quick. There's another one of those guys with the jets. I want his jets. Get back here. Aw, oh, you stupid bubble. That bubble just pushed us so we couldn't chase it. Ah, get off my back. There it is. No, that ain't the one. That's just a snack. So let's eat him and be good. Where's that fish? Don't worry, I'll save you. They want to chase you, I'll, I'll come after them and sting them too. Yeah, look at this. They're gonna go after that one now. See, we don't... Our own species won't hurt us. So we can run into them all we want. But, uh, we will be competing with, for food with them. There you are. There's the little guy I was chasing. Get back here. Ah! Dang it. He's so fast. So fast, I can't keep up with it. There we go. Almost? Almost? Yes! Oh! He hit me first. Dang. Ah, I want those jets. Alright, so we're starting to lose health quite a bit here. We need to find a food source quick. And there's that little guy again. Now he just sped off. Well, there's a little one up here. I'll just go smack on him. Eat it. Come back here, fish. Gotcha. And we can totally eat these little guys too. You guys are nothing to us. Rah! We are the demons of the sea. Thanks for flying into my mouth. <laughs> Our species is so dominant in the sea right now. Yeah, yeah, I don't fear you. Ow. Okay, maybe I did a little bit. <laughs> Snack. Let's swing around the backside of this guy and just munch on him that way. He's dead. We rock. Fish of the sea. Now I can go swallow this big guy and get his little, uh, thing. Ow. You wanna munch on me, punks? Alright. Go sting yourself. My spikes aren't something to play with. And so we've seen something else up here. This guy here. He's got electrical currents. We want to kill him. There we go. 
So we can get the electrical currents now. We got that from that guy. There's only one other. Ow. Whoa, man. Those are two big, big fish after us. You ruined my meal. These little blue guys, man, they are vicious. They're after my species left and right. So we're going to just start eliminating some of them now that I'm bigger. Yikes. Oh, man. Not looking good for us. Not looking good at all. Ah, somebody killed one of my species. No, that's not a good place to be in. Oh, man. Man, they're fierce. Ow, get off my back, dude. I'm just trying to survive in the sea here. So we need more DNA points to give ourselves some of that electricity, I, I think. Let's get this little guy here, if we can catch him. He looks like one of those little red guys that had the spikes that bullied our species. You bullies don't deserve to live. We're gonna just totally wipe you guys out. Ow. This is a big guy here. How did he hit me? That didn't it? That's not spikes or anything. How did they hit me? Ow. I need this food quick. Alright, let's go snack this guy. There we go. Punks. Picking on my species. Such bullies, man. They're all bullies. So I need like 15 points to get the uh, electricity. Let's see, I'm just go take this guy out. There we go. Give me all that food. More DNA. Alright, let's call our mate. She's up here. The male species of these aliens uh, lays the eggs. Oh, come on. I'm too big for her now. <laughs> Guess they take the term literally. Too big to like. Alright guys, so that's going to be it for part one of our playing of Spore. Uh, I walk through, play through thing. Uh, I might separate the uh, building things later on into their own separate little video because it might take a little while. But I, I don't tend to take a whole lot of time on those, so I don't, I don't think it's going to be too big of a deal. So I like this uh, shape of the uh, form here. And aside from that, uh, the spike button is evolving. So I will see you guys next time with part two, and we will show you the modified version of this species. Fit for the bigger seas, and it's almost time for it to crawl out of sea and onto land. Soon enough, we will do that. Until then, I will see you guys around, and uh, be sure to hit that like button. Helps me out a lot, helps us out a lot, and uh, yeah, if you guys haven't subscribed yet, hit that subscribe button too. Thank you guys for watching. See you around. And there we are. The little tide pool of cells and creatures. Alright. So we gotta go around and basically eat to survive. These little red chunks are meat. Since we are carnivores, we want to eat the meat. Okay, back here. We can also eat these little guys too. Yeah, you. Eat him. Go. Get it. I don't know how to speed up, guys, so, yeah. Yeah. We're gonna be so vicious and scary to all these other creatures. I'm gonna go attack this guy with the uh, spikes. Actually, we'll go hit this big guy right here and see if we can kill him. Yeah, eat that. Ow. Oh. Ah, we ate the bigger guy. So much bigger than us and we totally ate him. So basically there's uh, several stages to this game and each one is more difficult than the last. And I found the tribal stage to be the most difficult to be honest because uh, if you're not quick in that one, it's really difficult. What's up guys and welcome to Spore. Today we're going to be playing this game and uh, it's basically a game that has a fun little take on the uh, evolutionary chain of things. You uh, create a cell, create a creature, you come to the place on a on a comet, I guess. And so we get to choose our little world here, and we can customize our creatures quite a bit. I'm thinking maybe this desert planet here. Yeah, let's do that. 
Sure, let's start in the cell stage. We're gonna be a carnivore. We're totally gonna be a carnivore. We don't have any themes, so we can't set a theme. I'm gonna go with normal. And we get a name our planet. Why not Alterima? I don't know, just what came to mind. Now we've entered the galaxy. Aboard a comet. Flying through the sun. Just shy of hitting a solar flare. And now we impact the planets, Alterima. Never to be heard from again. Oh wait, never mind. Wrong story, guys. Wrong story. We were heard from again. Deep within the oceans. I wonder what would happen if we landed on a planet without oceans. <laughs> there are planets without oceans. 